Welcome back to Attack of the Lonesome. Still by myself. Everyone's still ripping. Don't really care. And maybe I enjoy time by myself. You know? I get a little... Going on. <laughs> but here we are. And we got this beautiful... Ugh, this is not beautiful whatsoever. This, this looks like a fucking villager with elephantitis on his nose. They do have big noses, but this is going over the limits. Their nose is not that big. It's not that big. So I made a... Well, I haven't really finished it yet, but I made something here. And what I'm going to need right now, before it's nighttime, we gotta make a little something called Grout. And I was gonna get Jack to help me with this episode, but I cannot get in contact with him. Because... Uh, Apparently Jack is the busiest person in the world. Not really, I know for a fact he's not busy. And that I told him like 30 times, I know he had to read one of the messages because he replied to me a couple times. Get off of D&D, you faggot. Or get off of Do Not Disturb, you faggot. And he's still on Do Not Disturb, so when we do actually get a time to both be on at once and be able to record, he's on Do Not Disturb and he won't be able to get the message of, hey, Jack, I can record, how about you? So good for him, he's fucking retarded. And the day that he was able, to, he was home and actually got a message and I got home, he said, oh, I gotta go to a birthday party. If you don't think, if you think I'm lying, I got pictures to prove it. And I'm like, I don't fucking care. You bitch, just get off and do not disturb. He's still on do not disturb, though. One day in the future, we will get him. Hopefully, we'll actually, I'll get a session down with someone else by the end of, well, before I go on vacation, which is very soon. Because what the fuck is on your head? What the hell is that? What the fuck? Give me that. Give me it. I want it. Alright, so what do we need to make grout? We need clay, sand, and gravel. Now, do we have sand? We have to have sand somewhere. Now, what we need this grout for is to make seared bricks. You see right here? And with seared bricks, we make all the smelty stuff for Tinker's Construct. And uh, what we need that for, let's go ahead and put all the blocks like that. What we need that for is to make, uh, well, you'll see, this is, this is what this uh, villager thing is lean up to. I will make it more detailed in the future and better, but the pink conveyor belts are pretty much like a tongue, and the tongue will lean to something else you will see in the future. But uh, right now, we might have to go to bed in a bit. Hold up. Where is gravel? I just... I need to pinpoint a location for gravel. I'm guessing it's gonna be some in that ravine I found over there. But let's go ahead and go to sleep. Cause I ain't trying to get any of my villagers deaded. We only have one iron golem protecting the area. And uh, I would not, I would not like to see my villagers go to waste. Even though I can start spawning them in now that I have a power system set up. I, there's some of them that are special to me. Like this guy right here, this is Joseph. Joseph got the shittiest trade in the world, and that's why I don't want to talk to him anymore. Fuck you, Joseph. Alright, moving on. That's Jose. Hey, up, Jose. Alright, let's go over here. Save, I'm saving a specific a specific episode. This was going to be an episode, one of Jack's first episodes, but he's still not here, so that's why. Fuck you, Jack. And the episode I am saving for him is going to be a pretty fun one. And, well, at least I'm going to see his reaction. My reaction was off camera because I saw a video of it. I was like, whoa, what the fuck? These things are amazing. And it, we, you will see those in, in the future very soon. Because I know I'll, I know for a fact I will get a session with Jack. I'm determined. Hopefully tomorrow I can get a session. I don't actually know because I might be busy tomorrow. It's sort of like a trade-off. Like one day I'm busy, one day he's busy. And uh, just, um, Ryan is dead. Rip Ryan. Rest in peace. Applications for the server are not open. I don't know if I said that in one of the episodes. I think I did, but what I meant to say is I'm looking for fairly popular YouTubers, some thousand subscribers we do, to get them to help spread the popularity of the series and to get them on the server if they're willing to. I don't really care. I'm just looking, looking for homies to play with until the OG homies get back back from the grave wherever they are I'm gonna have to go get my lightning store stored sword and resurrect them from the dead sorry if there's like noises that you hear from my fucking curtains over there it's a little bit hot is it it was like a 90 degrees in this area and I live in the bay area 
uh, and it was fucking hot as hell. I don't know what the Bay Area is. It's a uh, peninsula of in California. It, it's usually always. Uh, my mouse is having a seizure. I keep mining this alarm soon. I don't want it. Uh, not yet, that is. But it's usually always cold here. And if it's hot, it's usually cold at night or something. Cold in the morning before it gets hot outside. But it hit 90 two days in a row here. And it's not even... What, it's still spring? It's not summer yet? I'm not sure. But holy shit, that's a rare occurrence to happen here. Occurrence? 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 Alright, how do we make this again? I know there's like a specific area. This recipe is what we want. And hopefully this gets us a lot. My mouse is having a seizure all of a sudden. I don't know why. It's like, look at this, look at this. I'm trying to move it on the open squares, but it's like moving the opposite direction. My keyboard broke, sadly. I don't know how. It was working one day, but then I got home and started using it. It just didn't work whatsoever. So I don't really know what to say there. Uh, let's throw this in here. Let's throw the... Uh, Let's throw these in here and boom so that should smelt up some seared bricks so let me show you how this works so am I bad I am a bad so as you see here we got conveyor belts and we got an auto spawner with the safari net reusable villager in there and uh, it's got the mob essence it has the energy it's got the work you know you all that and then we got a steam dynamo which doesn't have any steam in it and we got our leadstone energy conduit and under the steam dynamo which, uh, I'm not gonna take out oh my god there is a aqueous automaton and uh, inside that there is water obviously but I have this hopper here and the hopper is connected to a lever and that will fuel in coal when needed the fuel in coal when needed to turn on the machine so if I hit it real fast and then turn it off, we should get something to spawn if the scene on the starts working. Yep, there we go. We got a villager to spawn right here. Fucking useless villager. And uh maybe yeah, uh, it'll spawn another one. Here we go. And we got another villager, he's fairly useful. But that, that's how that works. Now the thing what I want with it is I want emeralds. And and uh, emeralds aren't the easiest renewable resource to obtain. I don't think you're even able to retain it attain it obtain it there you go other than this way because we don't have any bees on this mod pack which i'm happy with so it's not like a typical technique pack. this is a good mod pack because it has a lot more interesting things to do in it other than uh technical machines and, hello oh that's uh okay trade not the greatest but this should yeah it should be off now and they dropped off four villages with just one piece of coal four villages that's pretty that's pretty insane and now what I'm going to use the villagers for is I'm going to drop them in a smeltery. And when you drop them, hold on, I'll show you the book here. I will show you the book. We should get a book. We did not get a book. Do I need to make a like an entire brick? But as you see, here, we'll make a brick here. If my mouse would stop having a seizure. We'll make a brick. There you go, we got the book. Mighty smelting. So, let's go ahead and find the part about the buckets. Here we go. There exists... There exist a few liquids that are gained through strange means. Currently, known liquids are blood, damaging entities in the smeltery. So you can put a pig in there, you can put sheep in there, you can put like any mob in there, but Enderman. Uh, to obtain blood, there is liquefied emeralds, melting down emeralds, or villages. So this is what we have the farm for, is to get emeralds out of this. Sorry to hear a lot of clicking, I'm like, I'm like trying to make my mouse stop having a seizure, I'm like rubbing it down rub my mouse pad down too. Glue, melting down horses in the smeltery. That would be interesting because I have no idea what glue is for. Slime, found on Slime Island. It functions as a spawner. So yeah, there's that blue liquid we found up there. Ender, ender liquid, either melting down ender pearls or ender mint. So, that, this is really what we're using this thing for. It's for a bunch of villagers that we can just get a bunch of emeralds off of. Find and dandy after that. Oh, there's a mouthful. <clears throat> but let's make some seared bricks here. We probably don't want to waste them all just like that because we do have to actually craft some things here. These villagers need to shut the fuck up. I'm going over here, the, the empty part of town where no villagers stay for some reason. I don't really know why every villager place is like that. But what we are gonna need is <clears throat> smeltery drain. 
smeltery control is one of the important ones, so let's get that. Which is like this. Bam. Hold up, we're gonna need to get rid of some stuff here. Our inventory's fairly full. Let us try and get rid of some items here. Maybe throw the bricks open. Oh, nice, maybe throw the bricks in here. Uh, throw this in here. Bones? Do we have a place for bones? Yes. Okay, so. Let's go back over here where it's nice and quiet. And we need. What else do we need? We need this, the drain. This is useful. Boom, this drain. What else? We need. Seared tank, which is glass. Which, surprisingly, I do have a lot of glass. For some reason, I just thought of smelting glass when I started the village here. Not really started the village here, but. When I first, you know, conquered the village, made on my own, I smelted a fuck ton of glass, a bunch of sand. Smelted a bunch of sand, I got a bunch of glass for some reason. I don't know, I was just feeling the urge. Maybe I would need glass in the future. And indeed, I did. So what else do we need? Sear glass, keep any fluids it has when harvested. And uh, that don't matter too much. We do need that, the faucet, and the casting table. Jesus Christ, my fucking window just got... Not my window. My curtains got like sucked out the window. That scared the shit out of me. But, uh, okay. Let's see here. Let me see some of this here. Let me see a basic setup. Boom. So that's a basic setup. Mmm. Mmm. You don't need that block in the middle. That's just randomly there. Alright, so. These are the main blocks right here. We're gonna also need a shovel. And we are gonna need the rest of these to be turned into bricks. Okay. So, where is a shovel? I need to make one. Let us make a shovel. Uh, do I have iron? I do not have iron. I do not have... Uh, let's just make... Yeah, in bar sure. Pretty sure iron was in there, but I was just too lazy to look. Let's just make an in bar shovel. Because in bar is something I never use. And let's throw this in here, this in here, and this in here. Just clear out the inventory a little bit. Oh! Oh, the lag is real. Oh, hit me with that. All right, we're going to go into human form. Just make this a little bit uh, less complicated to look at. And we're going to put on a raccoon hat. Just because... That's right. Uh, <clears throat> so how big does this thing need to be? How big does it need to be, indeed? It needs to be... So, 3x3. Three three, and then the sides. Okay, I understand that. So, it will have to be like this thing. This will be the 3x3 three three area right here. So this is the 3x3. Three three. Boom, right there. Well, let's get this shit. Might as well get this shit. It's just right here. I'll take it. And I actually want to talk about Mechacraft. Because Mechacraft may or may not be, be put to rest. Or have to be fucking made another... Uh, make another new world to start, off, start up the season again. I don't know what's wrong with that mod pack. There is something about the MechaCraft mod pack that makes it crash all the time. And when I say makes it crash all the time, I finished a session on it not that long ago. It's fucking night time again. I finished a session on it, it was the Emperor Scorpion session. And today I wanted to record another episode because I felt like I needed a Minecraft episode to go up. And <clears throat> any Minecraft series episode to go up. And I wanted to make an episode off of that. And of course when I try to make an episode off of it, the worst comes to worst, and the mod pack, the world will not open. The mod pack opens, I can open up other worlds, but the MechaCraft world itself will not open. Take a sip right there, alright. And I don't know what to do, I tried other things. I updated the new spawn thing, that wasn't the problem. Uh, I took out CandyCraft and some of the errors, so I put CandyCraft back in, and fixed all the other things, that wasn't the problem. I took out mods that said, uh had problems and that wasn't the problem either so i don't really know what what else to say other than like rip mechacraft once again nice for you to be with us for two more seconds uh but yeah i don't really, I don't really know i don't really know guys i'm just i'm gonna leave it to rest right now i'll figure out something in the future i'll we'll have to see from there but uh Oh, that's how you make it. You fucking chisel it. Well, I'm too lazy to chisel it, so we'll just, we'll just stick to our what we got going on right here. 
Cause I was gonna make a make a little bit. Oh, you fucker! Oh, hell nah! Nah, get out of here! Get out of here! He's useless, Iron Golem. Look at him. He got pushed by that villager. You gotta get. You getting pushed around by a villager. Why do I expect him to be the be the savior of my village when he's just pushed around like that? You little bitch, Iron Golem. Okay, you can go. You can go. <clears throat> that dude can leave. This is no one's really starting to bother me. But, uh, I might have to make a little crater here. Just to make this area look nice. But, uh, we have a smelter drain here. We have to space it out a little bit more. Take off these corners a little bit. We have a smelter drain right here. We'll put a sear tank here. And we'll put the controller in the middle. Boom, right there. And then we're gonna need more stuff for grout. We need more gravel and we need more clay. There you go. So where is some more clay and some more gravel? So yeah, Mechacraft, I might have to restart this season yet again. I'm not even gonna make my place look nice. We're just gonna have like a shit shack. I'm pretty much gonna turn it into like season three where I had chests full of random crap. I'm just trying to make my place look beautiful. Of course, when I do make it look beautiful, the world will not start up anymore. Hooray for that. Can I get a moment of silence for Mechacraft Season 4, The Second World? Moment of silence right now, please. Okay, that's enough of that. But yeah, I'll start up the season again eventually, and we will just... I'll just, I don't know, focus on the ore spawn mod, at least for the beginning of the, sea, the new world of the fourth season, the third world of the fourth season, and we'll go from there, and uh, hopefully I'll be able to finish the ore spawn mod, and then we'll focus on the other mods after that, because ore spawn has a lot to do with it, and especially with the new update. I'm actually okay with having to uh, restart the world right now, due to the fact that ore spawn has some new stuff, and I didn't want to go really far just to find the new things. So yeah, I'm a little bit okay with having to start over. Not too okay though. I'd rather not start over. Because, you know, it happens. It happens with mod packs. And probably I'm not gonna make it a public mod pack anymore. Due to the fact that shit that happens, shit like that happens all the time. Oh. Maybe I should get a bite of some of this right here. Some of this gelatinous slime dropper is what me and Jirachi like to call goop. Eat some of the slime goop. Mmm, so good. You just hang up, uh, gelatinous slime balls on there. And you get some beautiful, tasty gloop goop. Galoop. And I'm, I want to talk about the future of my channel, like I usually like to do. And as in future, as in uh, 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 when I'm on vacation, there's probably not going to be much upload to it. I'll schedule some videos. But other than that, uh, I want to start a new series in the future. A Fallout, a Fallout game, potentially, in the future. It's gonna be uh, more than just like a regular Fallout playthrough. You guys will see when I get to it. It's gonna be fun though. Definitely gonna be fun, and I can't wait for it. Uh, there's gonna be multiple other series in the future, and sooner or later, sooner or later, I will buy a new computer. But that's a long time from now. We're not gonna worry about that at this particular moment. Uh, I gotta rack up money first of all. You know that's usually a good thing to do when you're buying a computer. I've been saving up a good amount from each paycheck that I get from Zoomin, my beautiful and amazing company that is my, my, I was going to say sponsor, is my uh, partnered network, Zoomin.tv Games, you know, go subscribe to them, they're on my crackheads list, and crackheads means friends, by the way. Oh, if you guys didn't know, welcome crackheads, there you go. I almost forgot that, I gotta, I gotta get used to saying that every time. Is this ready to be a, it is. It indeed is, as you see the thing is ready right there. Uh, the higher we make it, the more it can store. So we'll definitely just get a couple more things smelted up here. But what we need now, we need to put lava into the smeltery drain. So let me open up my map here. And we're gonna do a little bit of tele teleporting. Here, which I'm gonna allow everyone to do on the server because we don't want to walk everywhere or fly everywhere I guess. We're still lagging or are we good now? I think we're good. 
Uh, can I make another bucket? No, I do not have iron. So let's just head back to the house. This single bucket should be able to uh, help us for now. Now, did I like stutter or something? Uh, let's go back here. Did I stutter, bitch? As you see, everyone's wearing some stupid ass hat. What are you wearing? What the fuck are you wearing? I think you're. What the hell? Is, I don't even know what that is. It's like a hamster hat. Okay. <clears throat> so let's put lava in here. Boom. And now the smeltery should work. And, uh. Uh, what we need is liquid, I believe. We need some sort of liquid in here, first of all. And that's what we'll do. We'll get some liquid in there. And what this liquid is used for is to burn the villagers. And we need a fair amount to actually burn up some villagers. Huh? Let's throw that in there. Boom. There might be some more jump cuts once I set all this up. Okay, it is all set up. Let's go ahead and dress in, dress in our appropriate outfit here. Wait, do I not have a villager? Oh, I do. Okay, good. Drop in just into our appropriate outfit here. We got blood in there because I wanted to test it out. As you see, blood. So this should give us blood and emeralds. And we got the tongue fully stretched in. And we're also going to need this item over here. Which is this uh, XP extractor item. And uh, I believe I can use it in like this range or so. Well, not really use it in this range or so, but... Okay. Oh shit, that's not good. Come on! Get my- Fuck. Fuck, now I need to go down there. <laughs> Alright, back into bat mode. Didn't expect that to happen. Oh, you better get the fuck out of there. Alright. I just need to uh, insert more XP into this baby. Boom. And uh, here we go. Let's just let's manually put in a piece of coal. Just to start it up here. Okay, I know I can- Get it, get it, right there, oh shit, don't go in though. Okay, we'll just go in and back and hit the switch once. There you go. And that should ignite it. And we should see villains just drop in. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. What the fuck? You hacking ass. Piece of shit. Oh, he still went in anyways. He went in on his own. Oh, he went in too. Your trade sucks dick, so I'm happy you're in there. Let's just... Yep, there you go, that should work. Boom! Rip! And as you see, the fl the liquids are green. We got emeralds coming in here. Not a lot of emeralds, they take a while to build up. Two villagers equals one emerald. I, well, no, equals half of an emerald. So let's just turn that on a little bit. Give it, give it a little bit to put even more in there. And we have this guy, he's from uh, Witchery. And he's in here, you know, he's he's uh, giving us some emeralds. Thank you, sir. Thank you, my kind sir. Let's just go ahead and... That's probably not going to be smooth. That's probably going to be this giant-ass thing. But as you see, they are very nice because they are contributing to my stacks and stacks of emeralds. And whatever I will use emeralds for. This guy... He's fucking breaking the system. What are you doing? Stop. You're making me drop frames because you did that. What kind of trade do you have, sir? You want a safari net? It is a mystery. What? Oh! Oh, okay, well he's dead now. It is a mystery. I want that. But where the fuck did you come from? You're a hacker. You're a fucking hacker. Oh yeah. This is so beautiful. You're dying. I love it. I love it so much. Mmm, emeralds. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. I'm gonna go uh, sniff some crack or something, you know, go chill down because all this uh, villagers dying is giving, giving me a little bit too hype. We have a total of three emeralds. That's insane, bro. For life, crackheads, it's sadder than the night.